Half-Life 2 RTX released its first public demo and there are really only two types of people. Those that think the game is way too demanding and impossible to play if you don't have a high-end Nvidia card, and those of us that are not broke. But rage baiting aside, while I do understand the people that are frustrated that they're not able to play it, I still think Half-Life 2 RTX is pretty damn impressive. You can't forget, this isn't a case of bad optimization. This is pure path tracing, the most realistic rendering technique we have. Even Pixar didn't start rendering their films using path tracing until 2016. And here we are just using it to render out video games in real time, even if it's at like 20 FPS. And sure, GPUs may not be powerful enough for path tracing to be viable for most games, but the fact that it even exists in games is super cool. If you think about it, we've basically entered the final chapter of video game graphics. Like, this is it. We're pretty much just simulating how light behaves. It doesn't get more realistic than this. And sure, the frame rates suck and the quality isn't perfect yet, but we're in the endgame now. Or maybe we'll just head down the wrong path and start rendering all our games using AI.